lyrical, miracle, the sexual, intellectual, the cunning linguist, and the quintessential stud muffin. Joel, the fit of my part in your girlfriend's parts is always nice and snug, and you are enjoying watching pro wrestling unplugged. Keep watching and have yourself an eyegasm. His opponent this evening measures in at a solid 10 and a half inches and hails from South Philly, Japan. He is Trent Acid. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Matt Hardy, the man who is stronger than death, and I've been gifted to have an amazing career as a professional wrestler. And if you live in California or on the West Coast, now you have the chance to be a professional wrestler as well. You can go to k -Fabe College. Shh, don't tell them you heard it from me, but k -Fabe College is the place to go. Billy Blade and the Ballers, three of the best talents on the West Coast, will train you and they will help you to achieve your dream of being a professional wrestler. And one day, when you step in the ring with Matt Hardy in a TLC match, I don't know who trained you, so I don't know how to beat you. Go check it out. KFED College, Matt Hardy says so. Trent Acid now running around the ring, taking his good old time to get back into the ring. Oh, 
Ladies and gentlemen, he is led to the ring by discount. From South Philadelphia, Japan, introducing the international superstar, this is Trent Acid! Look at that sinister face on his manager, Jimmy Donovan. You gotta do the do. Trent needs to get more money for out in the crowd. Well, you know, he wasn't booked last month. He's got to make up for it. Now he's just getting a little action, even if he is 50. Only 50? Well. I'm surprised that he's so generous, Chief. I'm not very generous to women, usually. Long story. But Trent Acid, generous amount of ability, and he's going to need it all tonight against Joey Matthews. More money Trent Acid's got. He's that thing out of his shorts. Looks like he's running a pawn shop down there. He's looking to go on his winning ways here and get a shot at the championship at the third anniversary, September 15th, 2007, here at the New Orleans Arena. Here is a man who's traveled the world over, won almost every recognizable title he can win. Here is Joey Nash. And speaking of third anniversary, here's a man who's no stranger to red market arrivals, Joey Matthews, as he is ready to take aim and win his first title in PWU, but he's on track for tonight. What a hell of a road. Pete is going to have his answer for that. Oh, look at this guy. A superstar. He's a superstar, Jake. You know what? You know nothing about being a superstar, so where are you to get off and mocking him? Jake, I am a god of all media. Please. Well, I'm the Tom Cruise of announcing. Yeah, you got no rebuttal for that. As these two go face to face in the ring, friends collide, contenders match, and there's already trash talking from the shot at the goal on the line. Weighted tonight at 211 pounds from Los Angeles, California. friends accomplishments as you all know I'm a very important person I got something very important to say and I require complete silence immediately I will contribute to the Lindsay Lohan fund it's got to be friends with her he knows all the Hollywood a listeners he helped free Paris Contrary to popular belief, I did not get fired. I am on a self-imposed summer vacation from the WWE. Thank That's, you amazing. Very much. That's amazing. That's amazing. Self-imposed summer vacation. I landed in Philadelphia International Airport this morning. I took the short drive up 95 and I was thinking there's a friend of mine, an old friend by the name of Trent Acid. I haven't seen him in four years and I was going to see him tonight. Much to my chagrin, I show up at this building. I see Trent Acid, one of the first people I saw. I shake, I stick my hand out for him to shake it. I said, Trent, how are you? Good to see you, pal. Trent Acid looked at my hand, put his hands in his pockets, and he walked away from me. Why that, mother? But Trent Acid has not forgotten his roots here in Philadelphia like Joey Matthews At first I was offended and rightfully so. What a sign of disrespect for one of the greatest sports entertainers in the world today. I concur. 
You see, Trent, jealousy will only get you so far. You see, Trent Aston and myself wrestled in this building about four years ago. I come back to see him today, and he's jealous. He's jealous because he doesn't look as good as I look. He's jealous because he didn't make it as far as I did. He's jealous because he didn't make hundreds of thousands of dollars like Joey Matthews did. He's jealous because he wasn't on national TV. He's jealous because just like all of you morons, he should be down on his hands and knees kissing my beautiful white butt for coming back to Philadelphia. Yeah, he's got a hot ass. Trent Acid should be kissing him. Trent Acid, even though I'm ridiculously good looking, even though you're a professional wrestler and I'm a sports entertainer, even though... Even though I have all the ability in the world, I am not a good person. I do not do nice things. And when this man rings that bell, I am going to beat some respect into you. Ring the bell. He needs it. Matthews deserves no respect for the way he came in here and acted last month and again this month. You know, a lot of things this Joker said is true. I haven't seen you in four years, and the reason why I didn't shake your hand is because all that money you made and all the dreams that you followed just turned you into an asshole. What? He did. Matthew blew me off at a tailgate party last month at Crazy Eight. Well, that's you. Talking about respect, I deserve some respect too. These fans deserve respect. Hey, these fans are asking for Joey Matthews to present himself to them. You know something? Yeah, I am bitter, because frankly, you're just a backseat wannabe ripoff. You wanted to call yourself a chick magnet? Well, guess what? I got a bunch of girls in the front row giving me money every time I come to the ring. Yeah, well, it looks like you accused them, kicked them all in the face anyway. Don't be proud now, of that. enough of this talk, and you came here and disrespected the people. That's fine. I might have not seen eye to eye with these people along the years. But one thing I have in common with them is that I'm from Philadelphia. Which means you're trash. Them, Absolutely not. When you disrespect them, you disrespect me, and I'm going to kick your ass. What a foul mouth that Trent Acid has. Lock up in the center of the ring. Look at him. The two ghosts fight. Look at them. They're both enraged with fury. These former friends are colliding here to be a number one contender for the PW World Heavyweight title at the third anniversary this September. You know, pick me a winner. Who do you think is going to win? Trent Acid or Joey Matthews? Oh, what? Well, have I run to the backseat boys as of late? They seem to turn over New Leaf, realizing that. Well, they've burned a lot of leaves in the process to do that. But I think Trent Acid has the ability to come in on top and once again become the PW World Heavyweight title. You know what? He has the ability, but does he have the ability to beat Joey Matthews tonight? That's Rob Kick taking down Joey Matthews. Both men up and over the top rope and into the front row of the crowd here at the new Alhambra Arena. And right now, Trent Aston is at the advantage, trying to get the crowd behind him. They're already behind him. I don't think he has to try for that because they're all jealous of Joey Matthews. Trent Aston back into the ring right here. Joey Matthews is not looking very pretty, so to speak, on the outside. And then Trent Aston, up. Oh, oh, they land on the feet like a cat. It's almost a new Trent Aston. This Trent Aston looks really boring after taking last month off. Yeah, he actually hasn't been. He actually hasn't had a match as he defeat the Messiah at more than enough. And right now he's in firm control of this match on Joey Matthews. Trent Acid taking Joey Matthews, beating the pretty boy using these guardrails here. Taking a pillar to post, guardrail to guardrail. And what is he? Right. Oh. Trent Acid is no. Oh! Trent Acid, oh my goodness. Springboard off the second row! Oh! Taking out Joey Matthews! And almost taking out the front row here! Listen to this crowd getting behind Trent Acid and his crazy maneuvers here for Pro Wrestling Unplugged and Iron and Steel. 
Bell. This truly is a Trent Acid reborn here tonight. That's right. He just did an outside move on Joey Matthews. I don't know the last time I saw Trent Acid perform that move. With such precision, at least. Such precision. And right now he's mauling. Come you know, here. A lot of wrestlers would have tried to just take down their opponent real cleanly, to it, but Acid didn't care. He mauled Matthews because he wanted that cover. It's almost like since Johnny, the new Batman, Cat has become the new Batman, Trent Acid. It's almost inspired Trent Acid here. Well, Johnny Cashmere inspires many people. Trent Acid sending Matthews off the ropes. Oh, Matthews catch him up. Trent Acid up and over. Tried to land on Andrew, but cannot. Yeah, but he had a beautiful recovery. Landed on his feet on the floor. Trent Acid now going upstairs. Look at, look at Matthews here using Mike Keener. Hit Keener. Senior referee is wild. He's a thinking man's wrestler. He learned a lot. Oh, he's not a wrestler. He admitted himself. He's a sports entertainer. Well, sports entertainers are bad. Pro wrestling isn't real. Sports entertainment is real. That's where the heart and soul of this business is. I love that time in the front row. Vic fears Peter. But uh, I don't think Joey Matthews fears Peter with that jacket. Anymore. I know. I'm surprised he hasn't been covered in paint yet. Oh! oh. Hard shot sending out Trent Acid. You know, you almost wonder if these two had not seen each other until this match began, if we would be seeing a totally different match. They got under each other's skin just hours before this contest, and now they're taking it out on each other. We would probably be seeing a lot more clean cut Wait, wrestling that, style. Joey Matthews sitting that chair, distract the key and using another chair on Trent Acid. That dirty, rotten scoundrel. That genius is more like it. There's a fine line in between genius and being an a-hole. And Joey Matthews is definitely... He's over the line. He's an a-hole. You know, he's disrespected everybody in the back last month. Disrespected me personally, and now disrespected Trent Acid here tonight. So what? He disrespected you, and now you're trying to say that makes him a bad person? He disrespected everybody in this building. He forgot his roots and be going up to Stanford, Connecticut. Who would want to remember these roots? Beautiful, delayed. Suplex, Joey Matthews. British Bulldog style right there, just as effective. Over here, oh, kick out after two. Trent Acid kicks out, proving why he's been a champion around the world himself. He might not have made it big time yet, but he's been in Japan, he's been in Europe, in the King of Europe Cup, PW World Heavyweight Champion, as well as other titles. Well, I'm pretty sure PW and Japan are pretty big time, and Joey Matthews is just on summer vacation, dude. Joey Matthews is on the coast, on the vacation. He doesn't want to admit that he got fired. Yeah, well, fired. Yeah, well he's, ta he's taking Trent Acid to summer school right now, and he's beating a C-minus into him. Trent Acid. See, it's a new look at him. Firing back up here. It's a new Trent Acid. A determined Trent Acid. A Trent Acid wanting to put himself at PWU on the map. Oh, man. Double knee to the gut of oh, Joey Matthews. Tricked Trent Acid. Who is Boston Crab from the top turnbuckle? And he's using that turnbuckle almost uh, as an extra uh, leverage. Yeah, it's like putting your knee in someone's back. He's really knocking the wind out of him in the process. Oh, Stretching the back, the legs, and even the upper respiratory system. Joey Matthews, he, I hope he gets his just in here tonight. What did he do wrong? What just do we talk about? I just hate cocky people. I just hate. You know why? Because you don't have enough confidence to act cocky. You can't hear. Are you trying to tell me J Trent Acid isn't cocky? Oh. Uh, I, yeah, he's a bit cocky, but to an extent, he knows where his limits are. And a two count here, Trent Acid continuing on as this matchup here at Iron Steel, an event which later on tonight, Sid Vicious makes his debut to take on two gold Scorpio for the World Heavyweight title. And pretty much the winner of that match could be facing one of these two men at the third anniversary, September the 15th, right here at the New Ohio Marina. And you know what? 
both of these men are going to be watching that match very closely because they have got to prepare for whoever they will be facing at the anniversary show. I mean, granted, the title could change hands, but PW returns here on August 18th because the world champion has no way to prepare at that event. But tonight, a look up, driving that and rubbing in his boot into the gut of Trent Acid. Yeah, Trent Acid, he's had a long layoff. He had a hell of a match with Detox at Pro Wrestling Crest Fan Jam 2. two. And this match is exactly the type of, that was the exact match he needed to prepare for Joey Matthews here tonight. Oh, look at that. A backbreaker. Good. Applying the pressure on Trent Acid's back. Oh, couple knees. More than a couple. Good way to break out of that hole. It's an excellent way to break out of that hole. Trent Acid is definitely, he's not, he's not going down easy. I think Joey Matthews is superior, but Trent Acid is, is not going down easy. Big slam, Trent Acid down, Joey Matthews. Looks like he's going up top of the Yes, he is. He's going to the second row. Look at the scowl on Joey Matthews. That just breeds winner. Look at that. Oh, misses with the big elbow. And right now, Trent Acid's got to take advantage of this. Oh, oh look at that. Kicks, roaring elbow. Something you see on Street Fighter or something. Well, that's where Trent Acid learned to fight on the streets. I think. Look at him. Oh, oh, look at that pendulum kick. Oh, double springboard. Acid trip right there. I don't know what else you would call that. Oh, big tornado DDT and a cover here. One, two. Oh, and kicked out after two. How in the hell did he just kick out of that? By, not, by being in control of this match, most of the match, Joey Mercury is not being beat down quite as much as Trent Acid. So Trent Acid's moves aren't having the same impact on Joey Mercury that they normally would. Look at him, Trent Acid has performed two great moves and he can barely even get up right now. Well that Joel Jacker taking out Trent Acid. Looks like Joey Mercury's calling it. Ducks the clothesline. two after that big driving power bomb. Blue Thunder Driver only got a two count on Joey Matthews right there and Trent Acid has got to wonder what he's got to bust out next and it looks like he is signaling for the Yakuza kick. Trent, he's sizing up Joey Matthews. Oh, Matthews blocks it, rolls him up. He's got the dice, he's got, the oh, a kick down after two, I thought. Oh. I was hoping it was over. Acid slamming down Matthews. He's wasting too much time. Matthews. Oh, oh, misses with, wait, lands on his feet though. Ducks the clothesline, big super kick. Man, I think he knocked down a two. Cover here, one, two, oh, kick down after two. And you know what? When Trent Acid hits his about kick like that, because of those workers' boots he's got on, he really lays into it. Those are a lot more painful than wrestling boots. Steel tips. Steel tips, Timberlands. Trent Acid. Trent Acid going up there slowly. Oh, Matthews with a burst of energy, meeting Trent Acid in the corner. Both men are on the second rope. Trent Acid. Jockey for position, Dan. Shove it off Matthews. Trent Acid going upstairs here at the new Alhambra Arena. We said Matthews back up. Oh! Taking out Trent Acid. Taking out the money maker. The family jewels of Trent Acid. Yeah, he just busted the safe in that bank. Sperm bank. But right now, Joey Matthews. I got it, Jake. Don't worry. Joey Matthews is in firm control right now. And Joey Matthews last month, he superplexed Pete Hunter. Oh, and he's mocking Trent Acid. Beautiful. Wait, that Trent Acid goes through. No. Oh, kick out after two. Matthews looks completely frustrated and pissed off now. Trent Acid rolling him up in. Wait a second. Oh, Matthews lost grip a little bit there. But right now, that back to face it. He puts on the ropes. Oh, what? What is Keener doing? He's a veteran referee, Michael Keener is. He saw the fall on the ropes. Joey Matthews did not win 
this matchup. He should have. What did he do wrong? I don't care what they do up in Stanford, Connecticut. We don't prove of cheating here. Dude, what did he do wrong? What did he do wrong? Beat on the bottom ropes. You can't do that. Oh, that's illegal now? It's been illegal forever, Jake. Steel tip boots to the face of Joey Madden. What do you think? What? Oh, oh yeah. Good job, Peter. <laughs> what the hell is wrong with trying to spend all feet shenanigans as he pulling? Hey, you can't have arms try it, but it is illegal here in PW. You know, he doesn't have to try everything he sees others do. That is true. That is true. Trent has on the way slot here. Oh, low blow! Low blow! Keener didn't see it. Beautiful move by Joey Merker. Oh! Double arm. DDT. Picture perfect DDT. Two. He got him! I can't believe it. We have a new number one contender. Ladies and gentlemen, 12 minutes, 56 seconds. This man who walked the red carpet September the 15th on his way to a title shot against either Drew Paul Scorpio, Sid Vicious, or Rutgers. We can pick that title next month on LBC 18.